I'm Melissa. And I'm Paige. And, and we're, we're the Hot Mamas. Hot Mamas. <laughs> it's been a minute. So, uh, so, hey, Melissa. Yes. What are we doing today? Well, we're trying some new chips. Like a lot of new chips. Like a bunch of new chips. So, these are Japanese Lay's potato chips. And I don't think you can find these flavors here. So uh, you mean we can't find cucumber? <laughs> not that I found. Cucumber? Um, yeah. So like each of them is just slightly different. Some of them have English translations and some of them have not English translations. Exactly. So some of them are going to be real mysteries and some of them we're going to go in with at least somewhat of an idea. Some of these sound really cool. Others sound a little scarier. Yeah, they have some spicy. Oh, yeah. So we'll see if Japanese spicy is actually spicy because American spicy is not spicy. Well, and this spicy. one says numb and spicy, so I'm kind of curious. Are they going to numb you before they heat you up? Is it going to be like so hot that afterwards you feel numb? Maybe we should save that one for last. <laughs> we should try that one last. Yes. <laughs> just, in just, in just in case. Just in case. So, so we'll leave the spicy ones for last and maybe start with the refreshing cucumber. Hot cucumber. All right. These are actually pretty big bags too. Like I was expecting when I bought them for them to be like the little like one size. Right. right. Well, we should ask though how much of it's air. Yeah. <laughs> that's a shot at you, Liz. <laughs> uh, well, that's how much is air. <laughs> <laughs> Which is pretty typical. These have a very strong scent to them. I don't know if I'd call it cucumber. I definitely call it earthy though. It's, it's no big deal. There's no dill. I know. <laughs> <laughs> is my, there is no dill. <laughs> big or otherwise. All right, ready? Let's think. think. Whoa. <laughs> what? <laughs> What is that? <laughs> and why are people eating it? So I am picking up a little bit of cucumber. What's blowing my mind though is that they taste cold. Yeah! Weird. Yeah, I'm like, mm. <laughs> Do it again. It like, literally is like cold. I don't know. It tastes terrible though. I don't know. I'm weird. I kind of like it. <laughs> I know. I don't know. They do. They have a cold sensation to them. That is so crazy to me. But they're nasty. <laughs> yeah, they ain't great. <laughs> I don't like those. I don't like those at all. Okay. Next one is, it looks like shrimp. It says right up there. Uh, at the top, of uh, stir fried shrimp with chili and garlic. Okay, okay, okay. okay. That might be good. Um, I don't know about shrimp as a potato chip flavor, but we're about to find out. Yep. Uh, that makes me nervous. <laughs> it's okay. I have an aquarium. Oh my gosh, it does. It smells like it fish smells food. like fish food. It smells exactly like fish food. It smells exactly. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. <laughs> oh, these were supposed to be an easy one for us to do. <laughs> I was all excited. I was like, oh, no chances oh. of hiccups. Oh, the individual one you can pick up the chili, <laughs> but <laughs> it's chili mixed in with fish food. Sink. Sink. Hmm. Not hating that one. Actually, that one tastes good. Okay, that's just crazy to me. That is insane. That does taste like it, it. It has a shrimpy flavor to it, but it's not overpowering. Just don't smell don't it. Don't smell it. Don't smell it. <laughs> don't smell it first. The chili that you can taste in this. I don't taste a lot of garlic. A little bit. But it tastes like chili. It does taste like chili. Like really tastes like chili. Mm-hmm. I actually like that one. Yeah, they're not bad at all. Those are good. All right, oh. roasted garlic oyster flavored. So if you thought it was fish food before, <laughs> <laughs> it's a little fishy now. <laughs> oh, it doesn't smell as bad. Yeah, that one doesn't smell like fish food. I don't know what it smells like though. Is that what oysters smell like? No. Can't say go Doesn't out. Doesn't smell like oysters either. Yeah, I don't really go out like that. It kind of has a potato-y. 
like a little bit of a fermented smell to it, but not like super bad. Okay, ready? Dink. There's a little bit of an oyster flavor to it. I'm hit with the garlic. Like, the bam, garlic, garlic is strong. <laughs> the garlic is strong in this one. I don't hate it. Yeah. I the like the one shrimp one better. better. Uh-huh. Yeah. But, but I don't hate this. This one is Italian meat flavor. So spaghetti flavor? Spaghetti. Like um, spaghetti is a type of noodle. But marinara. Flavor. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Meaty marinara. They were picking up what we were putting down. <laughs> That's an odd flavor smell. I don't really smell Italian spices though. Mm -mm. They're pretty red. No, colored. even individually, and it doesn't really smell like tomato. Mm -mm. I don't know what that smell is. Stink. That is sweet and disgusting. Yeah. Ugh. It's really sweet. Not what I was expecting at all. Tastes like sweet meat. Smells like what? Tastes like sweet meat. Like mm. you, that has a little bit of a meaty flavor, but it's just sweet. Mm. Yeah. Like if you took hamburger meat, stir in some sugar, not good. That one, I would take the cucumber over that one, and I hated the cucumber. <laughs> Not cool. No. <laughs> Get it. <cool>. No. <laughs> it was a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> Even though it didn't have deal. <laughs> <laughs> no big deal. Come on, we don't know what it is. There looks like a chicken wing on there. It's like a funky shape, which I've never seen them like that, because it's almost like the ruffled, but like way more intense. Yes, intense ruffled. Yes. We'll have to see. It's nothing on the back to the English either. So, watch it. Oh, this is a chicken wing in Carolina Reaper. Ooh. It smells like chicken bouillon. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, my it God. It smells like chicken bouillon. <laughs> <laughs> At least I can say what it smells like. You're right? <laughs> those, those are, are some, some intense, yeah. intense those. ruffles. Them be some ruffles. That's crazy. Mm hmm. Ready? Dink. 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 It tastes like chicken bouillon. <laughs> I don't hate it at all. I don't know. love it. <laughs> but don't hate it. Yeah. No. <laughs> okay. Before we move on to the spicy, we're going to move on to the cheesy. These look like they're like... These vegan. also don't Forget have... Forget about it. They look Italian. <laughs> Are these even Lay's? They don't have the quite the Lay's guys, logo. That's what I was just thinking. It doesn't look like it says Lay's. Baked rice and corn extreme cheese flavor. So there is a flavor thing. But are these like an off brand? Does anyone know? I'm really confused now. This does not look like any of the other. Well, it doesn't look like even the same writing. I mean, like the same language. Well, it doesn't have the the circle, like the circle with the banner that you're used to seeing with Lay's. It doesn't have that. Instead, it's like a chip falling into cheese. Ooh, and those. Those look like Cheetos. Those look like Cheetos. Yeah. All right. Now, like here, have a bonus. They smell kind of sweet. They taste sweet. That's a different kind of cheesiness. I don't really like it. I don't mind it. We got that worse, but that's interesting. But but I'm not a big fan of it. All right, which one, the numb and spicy hot pot flavor or the spicy hot pot flavor? Let's go with the hot pot and see what, if we can tell the difference between the and two. And then we're going to tell you which one's hotter. Mm-hmm. If either of them are actually I'm hot. Telling you the see, numb. This, this is late. Mm -hmm. Circle banner. I don't think the other one was late. It didn't look like it. Unless they're like a lazy brand. A lazy brand. <laughs> Ooh. I don't like the smell of that. I don't even, I can't place it, but I don't like it. You know, 
It reminds me of pesto in a weird way. Does it? Yeah, there's like a Is sweet, that? herby smell to it. Okay, ready? Uh, Dink. Have you ever had a hot pot? No, I don't know what a hot pot is. Me neither. I was expecting like chilies and stuff. Like this one. This one tastes like chili. <laughs> this tastes like I think grass. I inhaled some of the dust though. I think this tastes like grass. Okay, I'm not picking up grass, but I don't like that one. There's like but it tastes like black pepper. There's like some pepperish to it, but it doesn't taste like chili peppers, it tastes like black pepper. Which is odd because like <coughs> They have chilies on it, right? And it doesn't look like there's any black pepper on this, but that's what the flavor. Grass and black pepper. It's a very, very interesting taste. I can't place it at all. And there's a little bit of sweetness to it. It does look like there's peppercorns on there. Isn't Maybe. that what those are? I don't know. I didn't know if they were I want to say it looks like there's some um, beef, maybe. Looks like beef, chilies, and peppercorns on there. Let's try the numb one. See if it's any better. So I'm not a fan of that. Tickles my ears though. It's like what? Yeah. It's not like spicy, spicy. It's got a little bit of something there, but it tickles the heck out of my ears, and that's why I was coughing. Oh my goodness, that's strange. <laughs> well, congratulations. I'm probably allergic. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not. I wonder if it's just the ruffles. If that's the difference with this, because look, these ones oh. are ruffly. But I don't know why they would call ruffles numb. Ooh. Does it smell hot? No. No? It smells like earth. <laughs> it smells like earth! Like I said, you're eating grass. It's a black pepper. This one actually almost looks like there's some oh, yeah. black pepper on it. Look at that. This is going to be more grassy. And more black peppery. Hmm. Ready? Pink. Oh, I'm gonna walk up. Oh my god. Oh. Why does this taste like durian? <laughs> <laughs> this has a very durian like. Is that what numb is? Is it durian? Oh. Blah. Guess which no. one we're not finishing. Woo! What? Didn't mind the oyster ones. These ones were fine, but it's like bouillon on a potato. Get down, eggs. <laughs> I love her. <laughs> well, the more I eat those, I don't like them. Really? really it's it's more, too bullion. It's too bouillon y. Yeah. The more I eat these, the more I like them. Mm -hmm. And the oyster ones aren't bad. The red sauce was weird. Too sweet. It just, it was sweet hamburger meat flavor. And I don't even know hamburger. Maybe like ground um, pork. Because it was almost too bland of a flavor. These ones aren't bad. But these ones are actually good. So one out of eight. <laughs> these ones. They're real bad. What are these? Thinnel. There's fennel in them. Oh, oh, I hate fennel. But there, it had, like, I know fennel's bad, but this almost tasted like durian to me. No, it wasn't good. But mm -hmm. I'm glad we put those last. <laughs> Yeah, might have ruined everything else. <laughs> right? I'm like, no, no, I ain't in. And they're not spicy. You're going to call something a hot pot. I would think it would be spicy hot. But maybe it's just because, like, you serve it hot? It could be, actually. Does anyone know that? Leave a comment for us about why they call these hot pots. 
I want to know. I'm very curious. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, we tried some more weird snacks. And we survived again. We did. We found one thing we liked. We're getting good at this. <laughs> <laughs> like. Subscribe. Comment down below. And as always. Stay, stay spicy. spicy.